Hello everybody, I'm James. I'm doing a Masters of Science Communication at ANU and I'm going to show you a picture and then we're going to see why it's funny. I haven't seen the picture yet so I'm going to just see it and see if I can give you some theories on why it's funny. <laughs> Maybe it's not funny but we'll see. I've got it. So we can see the scientist is like locked in the computer. It's <laughs> it's not that funny, <laughs> but like it's kind of funny. It's funny because it subverts your expectations. This image is good because it's not offensive. If we look at incongruence theory, it's just the fact that you expect the scientist to be doing something serious and then incongruent to your belief, something unexpected happens, but it's not too shocking and it's not too mundane. And that's where you get humor in that sweet spot, that Goldilocks zone. So we can see that it's a bit silly that the scientist has got themselves stuck in the computer. Uh, we might bring even a little bit of superiority into this. The superiority theory shows us that we can find humor by making fun of others. So, for example, you might laugh at children doing something silly, or if you're particularly mean, you can point fun at somebody and then make fun of them and bully them, and you can feel superior like that, which might be funny in the short term, but is not good and you shouldn't be using that in business or in any sort of communication because you'll lose your audience if you do that. They're not going to respond well to you. You're going to break that connection between you and your audience. We can see a little bit of superiority as well in that the audience can look at that scientist and you think, oh, what an idiot. Why, why did he do that? I'm so much better than a scientist that's stuck in a computer. I would never be that stupid. And it gives you a sense of superiority and you're able to do that because you're punching up as well. That's important not to punch down, even though I just said it was kind of funny to laugh at children. <laughs> it's nicer to punch up. Often we put scientists on a pedestal, so it's good to just take them down a notch. I have a question to finish up with for you. Which cliches can you see in this image that give us a location of where this is happening?